Massive win today. Uh, I'm really proud of the girls. Uh, really happy to uh, get my first goal, goal after my injury. And uh, it's amazing to see all the fans. Um, and yeah, then we go again on Wednesday. Emma, biggest home win of the season, 17 shots, 11 on target, 7 goals scored. How would you sum up your team's performance and their quality on the pitch today? I think that's long overdue and we needed that. We needed the goals, we needed that efficiency. Um, had some teething problems in the first half defensively where couldn't get the press right in the way that we wanted to but the team adapted to that and everyone who's coming to the team has performed well and it's, it's great to have Penila Harder back scoring from her first touch you know a great performance from everyone why do you say this performance was much needed and the result as well needed some goals you know, I think that gives the team confidence we understand how to be in this last stage of the season and I think the team displayed that in the behaviors um, see a lot of things we've been working on in the training ground and I think everything just came together in the right way. So many different goal scorers today. Special mention for Sophie Ingle getting her first WSL goal of the season, but also a special shout out as well for Penela Harder with everything she's gone through to get a brace today. Yeah, I mean, we've missed Penela Harder's goals, but in general, I don't think we've had enough goals from midfield um, for Erin and Sophie to score. Is, and Jesse is much needed. We, we need those goal contributions and done that while Sam isn't on the pitch. So I'm just happy for the whole squad. Speaking of Sam, do you know how she's doing? Yeah, she's fine. She, she wasn't feeling very well last night. Um, so I think a bit dehydrated, cramped up a little bit in her calf, but we, we decided not to take any risks. And can I have a final one from me? Four games left, two at home. What would you like to see from the team as the, as the run-in now comes to a conclusion? I know we're going to face a tough Leicester team come here. They're physical. I watched their game against Arsenal. I think they will be a difficult outfit to break down. They're fighting to stay in the league. I think we're going to have to match them on that first before you know our quality can shine. But we just got to take one at a time and keep going. Oh, Penilla, wow, 17 shots, 11 on target, seven goals scored. Two of those are yours, which we'll talk about. Sum up the team's brilliant performance today at Kings Meadow, please. Yeah, I mean, uh, I think we started a bit slow, but then we, we got the first goal and then we just uh, kept going. Um, I think we had some great finishing today. Uh, I think in the first half we had like five shots on target and four goals or something like this. So yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm really pleased. Magda Erickson, the captain, talked about the slow start from Liverpool's match and she's talked about previous slow starts as well. How important was it to get out the brooks quickly, particularly with Guru's goal at 12 minutes? Yeah, it's really important to get that first goal. Uh, I think as long as the opponent can uh, defend a long time without us scoring, then they get the hopes up. And when we can get a goal fast and, and get one more and one more, then uh, I think we close the game quite fast. So many different goal scorers today. You've been one of them, you getting your brace. Firstly, how special was it to hear the roar of the crowd when you came on to the pitch? It's amazing. Um, I mean, every time I've come on, they've been amazing and uh, cheering for me. Uh, I remember that when I got my comeback on Stamford Bridge, it was unbelievable. And I'm really, it makes me proud that they want to cheer on me in that way. 